Hi everybody, my name is Brian. And this is Jackerson here. And we are playing some retro video games. So, Super Metroid is the game. Jamie, you picked this game. Tell me yep. tell me a little bit about... Actually, let's listen to this real quick. What's... The last Metroid okay. is, is in captivity. The galaxy is at peace. Is that voice acting in the original game? Yeah. That's so dumb. <laughs> I <laughs> that, love the Japanese they had a, people a guy, to do English. They like had a guy working at the office do that. <laughs> He's like, who speaks the English the best? Oh, that's Kenichi Makagora. Yeah. Oh, get him in here. Yeah. Oh, my God. <laughs> I love how, how they speak English. I love it. <laughs> so this, is a, this isn't the first one. This is the first one. Are yeah, you... they're doing a recap right here. Oh, no, that's what I mean. But the one we're playing is not the first one. No, yeah. So that was the NES one, which is also a good game. Why aren't we playing that one? Uh, because I wanted you to play something you'd have fun with. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I mean, I, I mean, I get the the other aspect of it too, right? If people didn't play the NES, there's not much of a draw to it anymore. So I get. We that could side. always play. I've I've played it before actually. I, mm -hmm. I, on because these it's games so are, are on like Nintendo retro consoles all the time. Yeah, well, well, the Metroid on the NES, it's to be to be fair, it's a slow moving game. Mm -hmm. It's a slow moving game. So, so I love this. This I right here. This. That what's that jar? Yes. What's in the jar? That's a that's a Metroid. What's a Metroid? Um, Reed. <laughs> no, no, I want you to tell. No, me. <laughs> okay, yeah, no. So the Metroids are basically like uh, energy generating beings, mm -hmm. and um, that's that's the big uh, scientific oh, goal towards it is we can get like n nuclear type or everlasting <clears throat> energy. They're kyber harvested. crystals. Yes. So they're harvested. That's, that's the heart right. of of dead stars, right? They. Yeah, they were never harvested before because they just eat everybody because they're just pure energy. So they suck everything's energy out. And so um, she that was the first one she, she'd she ever got. And so then the scientists figured out how to harness it for good. But, uh-oh. Oh, no, what's going to happen? you got to call back. <laughs> Space <laughs> colony. <laughs> <laughs> Big circle thing. <laughs> here oh, go. here we go. Oh, okay, yeah. Well, going, dude, dude, the graphics from the cutscene to the game are like I didn't even know we were in the game yet. I thought we were, I thought we were still yeah. in the cutscene. It was that good. Yeah, no, this uh, this is arguably one of the best SNES games, uh, besides maybe like some Zelda games or something. I believe. We played Zelda last time, which I thought was a good yeah. game, but yeah. and and honestly, I I wouldn't mind if we actually played through that one some more. Like, yeah. I, I like after we stopped playing, I was like, mm, I would be okay with playing more. But I also just want to see new games. Like, that's like the struggle I have with on online. Like, I I I play the first thirty minutes of games, and then sometimes I'm like, well, I'd like to keep playing that game, but I also want to just, you know, I don't know if if people want to watch me play through. 30 minutes of the first part of the game. <laughs> well, I, I, I don't know. Yeah, I think they do, or else they wouldn't be viewing, right? Well, yeah, they want to watch viewers, that, so but I'm like, like but it. do they want me to continue to... Well, it's, you know how it is. I'm, I'm just not sure. Yeah. Hey, okay, anyways, let's play Metro. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on here? Oh, no! <laughs> yeah, you chose, dude. You were paying attention. <laughs> What's the space pterodactyl doing? <laughs> people are gonna love this part of the video, Brian. Especially people that know the game. Uh, They're gonna love it. You'll get a random in here. I don't who's have. I don't have a health stuff. meter. No, oh you no, do I do. Look at your energy. <laughs> people are gonna love this part, dude. <laughs> I've been waiting for this part, Brian. Ah, uh, why? Why? <laughs> <laughs> you just have to run away. <laughs> oh, Whoa! There you go. You didn't need to kill him. <laughs> is he gonna be destroyed? It's too funny. Oh Better get goodness. out of here. Dude, this is crazy. <laughs> this is some action-packed stuff going on here. Yeah, I'm telling you, dude. <laughs> this is the real deal. This is probably my favorite game, I believe, on the SNES. This is good music, too. It is. It's very good. Oh, no. Oh, get out of there. Oh, no. Hey. Don't be scared, it doesn't take your health. So just blast through it. Don't let it 
doesn't scare you. Oh no, I was trying to do a double jump. Yeah. But All this stuff doesn't yet. hurt you. It just seems <clears throat> like you should be dodging it to right. slow you down so you don't get off the ship. <laughs> <laughs> Oh no! Get up there, Brian! <laughs> get up there! Don't die! Oh no! You got it, dude! Don't I know, freak I'm out! Good. You got this! Yeah. Perfect! Good job, man! Man, that space colony was something else. My son, the first time he played this game, he died right there, and he threw the controller at the ground and said, I'm not playing this game. <laughs> <laughs> that's like no you are that's how i felt about it's like you're not giving up that's how i <laughs> oh it's that like, he's, i won't do it he's gonna remember that the rest of his life when his dad made him yeah, not I, quit I, well, he, he's heck of good at games now so he's probably happy now but yeah. he used to be like that a boss or whatever just throw the controller like, i won't do it no you are gonna defeat <laughs> yeah, ganon you do it. yeah that's right <laughs> You're, gonna do it You're not time. getting dinner until Ganon has been <laughs> defeated. <laughs> it's kind of like that, you know. You're going to learn work ethic, son. You don't know how to be a good gamer yet. <laughs> it's good game. I don't think I can and do no, that. And this is actually time. really enjoyable watching somebody that has no background knowledge of this mm -hmm. game to me. It's like big time enjoyable because everybody I've ever seen has had some type of knowledge. Right, and they're just bla like blazing Taylor. through it. They're like... Yeah. Yeah. No, this is this is really enjoyable for me to watch this one. Much more enjoyable than Zelda. But then again, I hear all the music and the sound effects this time too. Yeah. Because Brian's a genius, and he figured out screen share. <laughs> yeah. Well, whoever figured out Discord was a genius. Yeah, that's true. I uh, I love that guy. I talked with him. Alpha. Good man. Okay, so... Yeah, wh why don't we just all Discord for, our, for <clears throat> everything? That's what I'm gonna do. I've been using... I, I just... I actually just started using Discord more. Like, I'm, I'm on, like, a server now with some friends. And... So, I'm, I, awesome. I, I'm having the real experience where you get to go check all the funny memes people leave. Oh, fun. And... Yeah, you get to post on your little chat and stuff. Yeah. That is, that is an experience to Oh, be what I was gonna say is... Because you, you were saying that you're... First off, there's been nothing so far. This yeah. is, but it's great pacing because it's just like, okay, yeah. you know something's yeah. about to happen. I wish Music. I could teach you how to moonfall this part. <laughs> Speed running tactic. I could prob yeah, I could probably go faster, but I don't mind just taking it. No, it's okay. Time. It's totally okay. I'm just saying. I'm, and like I said, I bet you that you're going to get, o over the next year, you'll get a couple random people in here from the speed running community and, they're and gonna, the modding community. They're gonna like, I can't deal with this. <laughs> no, no, they will. I'm just, I'm just, ha you know, hat nodding. Yeah. Uh, I'll be doing that because I like the speed oh, running no. community. Oh. So I'll be tipping my hat to them quite a bit. Yeah. Yeah. So, so this is. So what, do, does this look familiar from the cutscenes? No. It's okay if it doesn't. <laughs> of course so it this doesn't. Was, this was from the first one, and this is where where she was like shooting Mother Brain in the first one. Oh, That's like the man. old leftover ro like rooms. That is epic. Yeah, it's pretty neat. Um. So I, I, all right. Before I forget, because you were saying like how your son like through the controller and was like, I'm not playing that. Yeah. Yeah, if, not if, that. if you watch the Darksiders 3 uh, uh -huh. video I put up last week, if you watch till uh -huh. the end or if you just skip to the end, that's exactly what I do. <laughs> like, <laughs> like, I'm, I'm not bad. playing this crap anymore. Crap, yeah. <laughs> like, um, have you played any of the Darksiders games? Um, I, you know, I've, I've always been interested because people always told me about it, but it was one of those games where I, I felt like it was like a Assassin's Creed type deal, right? I just felt like no. it was going to be kind of run of the mill, no. but it's not, is it? So, all right, so, so it's nice. I, I, I know what this is. Yes. So, um, I played Smash. I know what this is. <laughs> oh, no. That's right. Yeah. Oh, boy. Now, that's not as scary as you think because you said nothing's going on well we'll see okay there we go um so you can just crouch and shoot that block behind you so like you know if you press down once you crouch so just crouch shoot there you go and then you can jump uh, so press down 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 right down right, right. Twice. so there you go. so me uh darksiders i know we're playing metroid but let, let me tell you about darksiders real quick yeah um definitely. darksiders it's a, so like I think you would like the game. I don't like the game. 
Mm-hmm. I I think they're horrible. I they upset me. But they <laughs> so it, in the video if you watch it what I explain is like it it seems like it is a it's like what a um real quick, should I have gone back the other way? Um, you can get an extra missile tank pickup if, I go if this you way. go the okay. other way. So, but oh. you don't have to, right? Let's not but do it's that. Good right for, it's good for the mini boss. Okay, let's do, let's do it. So, let's do it. Um, yeah. Um, keep going. Yeah, about keep, Dark Siders. Yeah. yeah um, well, so the way, you're not the a way, big fan. The way, because... the way I describe it is that it yeah. seems like Dark Siders should have came out on the Nintendo 64. Okay. Because it's like an old school like platforming like. Beat him like um not a it's like a it's not a it's it's not a button smashing game it's like combo like oh so like devil plat- may cry it's like feel, kind right? of but not as crazy mm-hmm. it's more just like mm-hmm. it's more like this game where it's like you have okay. a few mu- okay, shoot, moves jump and shoot downward so get on top of there and jump and sh- there you go and then go ahead and just drop because those come back so you can get back up gotcha there you go um good so, um go ahead so it's like you have to just get i mean you do level up but you have to just kind of get better at the game it's like it's it's a platforming like combo game and then if you when you die you just have to go um you 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 have to just start over again on the whole level so it's like it's like an old school game like people like Uh, i people can't deal with that kind of stuff no no checkpoints like whatsoever there might have been but um the first level but, there but, wasn't, and I never could beat okay. the first boss. So, <laughs> dang, dang. Yeah, I I could have, I could have, but I was just like, I don't care about. No, this I game. get it. Yeah, and plus you're doing your, you're, you're just going through a bunch of games so people can see them. So this this can be frustrating. No, no, I, I got um, it. I got it. Okay, you got it. Sweet. Yeah. Um. Yeah. I am definitely interested now that you're saying that. I'm going to watch your video. Yeah. Um, and I'm going to check it out because I'm inter- I've always been interested, right? Um, mm-hmm. It's just one of those things where it was like, I, I don't know, you know? Yeah. That, it's just, well, it's kind of like a Assassin's Creed. When I first saw Assassin's Creed, it was like, it's like, on xbox 360 it was like oh everybody's doing this and i'm like i don't know i'll i think i'll stick with my halo 2 well, but i don't even know anyone i'm 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 it's weird to me that you. that um oh dang it it's weird to me that it's even it even has like a, a third game because i don't know who, i don't know anybody that plays darksiders that's it's not that yeah. popular you know yeah the only person i ever um spoke with that uh, recommended it was um uh, who was it I think it was Taylor. I think Taylor. Yeah. People said, that like old, old school games, I think would like yeah. that game or like Zelda or something. It's 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 right. it's kind of like that, but um Okay, I'll have to check it out. I'm definitely going to watch your video on it to see yeah. to to see the what you're talking about because the as- I'm interested. The as- I was just, go ahead. Well, it's like platforming matters in in the game like that like there'll be a boss fight and you have to like jump up on all these platforms to like hit him when he's doing an ultimate move and if you don't hit him he'll just kill you in one hit so it's yeah. like it's like the platforming matters <laughs> so that's super frustrating but oh, for yeah. but for people that like platforming games it's like that's cool you know like yeah because there's like just nin- not games like, like that ninja guy yeah or, or mega Xbox man or something or just like, like or this game like like right now yeah. the platforming matters if you fall it's you yeah. know it, it can be punishing yeah, something that would be interesting, I think, that we could figure out to do during these 30 minutes Let's Play mm-hmm. is, like, let's do a, um, let's do, like, a, a 10-minute version where I screen share back or something yeah. like that, and I show you all the, you know, the special tricks and things that could, that could speed you up, like, during this part or the fall or whatever. Yeah. Um, like I was saying, there's Moonfall and there's all these techniques and stuff in this game and it'd be kind of neat if the game called for it like if we did like a five minute thing where you know i just did a i would just wall jumped up this entire thing you know what yeah. i'm saying so but um be, but i love the idea and i think a lot of people will wall jump love the idea i just fell you... because i'm trying to wall jump because i heard you yeah. say that okay so <laughs> how you do uh. it is you you have to hold towards the wall and then you have to press the other direction and jump at the same time simultaneously so I'm not, so not like going to do that. I'm not going to. No, do you don't have to. It'll take forever. <laughs> but yeah, um, th- that's what I do the whole way up. I just yeah. wall jump the whole entire way up. So, but um, yeah, it's. Uh, 
I'm definitely interested in Darksiders and I'm going to give it a look and I'm going to play it and I'll let you know um, on next our next 30 minute run through what I what, what I thought. thought of it. Okay, cool. So, and what was the first one on was PlayStation 2, correct? Uh, I believe. It might it might have been PlayStation 3, but I'm not sure. Okay. But um okay. it yeah, it the um the one thing that's hilarious about it is is just the aesthetics are just mm -hmm. like they're definitely so like old. The, the aesthetics it's like because you're like one of you're like one of the four horsemen so it's but it's like oh, che it's horse. like che yeah. yeah but it's like cheesy and like chunky armor you know like that's cool it's <laughs> it's just it's so it's like so silly like but yeah. it takes itself ser like seriously like enough you know what i mean like yeah yeah, you can't mine. go there yeah, yet. The so, mine. so basically, I want you to go to the mini boss. So just keep going up top, and okay. then I'll tell you where to go. So, this so we can actually like, make some end. Progress. Yeah, so we can end on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I believe that after this mini boss, I, I don't know what what our time is, but I think that's probably a really significant. We're only place at to stop fifteen minutes. We can. It's depending on how the how it goes. Yeah, I just uh, I feel like that that's. That's like the point where the game gets started after that, because when you collect this item, that's like the progression item, right? Mm -hmm. For the game, so. Well, this one yeah. is too, the. Yeah, the ball is yeah. huge, but this one's even bigger, believe it or not, so. Is it the web or is it the mine? Uh, it's. Don't tell me, I, I don't guess tell it, me. Don't. Okay, I won't tell you. Find out when we defeat him. <laughs> okay, I'm just talking what? to my son. Yeah, he's he's uh, walking around his boxers. Like, yeah, no, that that ain't gonna fly, dude. <laughs> Come on. I love him, man. He's like gonna he'll be your biggest fan in probably the next two weeks. <laughs> He, I, did I ever tell you what he said when I showed him your your streaming stuff? I think so. I think you like. Yeah, he it. was just like. Yeah, I yeah. think I did last time, but he was just like, it's like, dude, you have a friend that's a streamer. Right. He, if you just see, it's it's like just seeing yourself on TV for the first time on like a exactly. home on like a home movie. And you're like, wait, yes. we're on. I'm on TV. Yes, you're like, that's yeah. right. <laughs> hey, you can come over here. You can you can scoot up and say hi. You can say hi, Brian. Hi, how's it going? It's going good, he said. Your dad was... Here. Can he hear? Here, I, 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 yeah, I'm going to put the headphones over so he can talk with you. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, how's it going? I'm doing great. Did Your dad told me that he makes you play video games and be really good. Or, is that true? Yeah. <laughs> it's all about the boss fights. So if you lose, does he make you? He makes you Tell him beat him. Press select. Oh, oh, you can still hear me. I'm going crazy. So, so go back to that door, Brian, and then uh, hit either I think believe it's X or select. That'll turn on your five missiles, but you need all five of them to open the door. So save them for the door. Got gotcha. you. Not this game. Yeah, it's his first time, so he's doing a lot of games. It's really fun. Yeah. Here's a tip. If you just run, you can just run through all the bad guys and they won't hit you once. Oh. Tell them what button that is. That's technically key, right? Um, it's technically key to run. Okay, thank you. That's so good. I'll do, I'll do that next time. Yeah, guy. so you don't have to see. You just have to look. Mm hmm played before remember what do, you, what do you think about this part he's never played before so he doesn't know what's happening <laughs> what, what's your bet you think he's gonna get it yeah okay so you have to hit his heart Give you energy if you shoot those balls. 
Oh, okay, thank you. Oh, he got me. <laughs> hey, you're a girl. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> All right, buddy. Did you make you say say bye to everybody? Bye. All right. Bye. It's good to see you, righty. Okay, go over there if you want to hang out. Okay, bud. All righty. Um, <laughs> so, um, are you gonna try it again, Brian? Yeah. Or what? Yeah, we got we got around twenty minutes. We got time. Sweet. I, yeah, I love the debrief afterwards too. So, if if you wouldn't mind. Um, on your 30 minute playthroughs if we could have 5 minutes to talk about it because yeah. I always like yeah, yeah. to hear what you think when we're done yeah we definitely so. will okay cool yeah so basically the big deal was um, is when he shoots yeah, out those you can eggs, shoot his stuff to get your health back and you know what else it gives you something that's missiles. really helpful missiles. missiles that's right that's right you knew it, you know it this buddy. is a video game that's right <laughs> I, um, I'm funny though because uh -huh. it doesn't matter whether it's an old or a new game I would hold on the missiles for dear life and never use them right not one time that's a good spot to be you want you want to see is that what's going on? yeah can you see from right there okay that's good good job you're you're already a professional <laughs> you'll be a professional in no time right? Well, it's streaming, it looks like, because you know that you need to be off screen, too. Yeah. All right, uh, I bet you got it this time. Yeah, uh, we'll see. Um, uh, your, your triggers, uh -huh. your L and R1, will shoot angles, too. Uh -huh. and that's very helpful. So, like, if you crouch, you can... Uh, I mean, always... <laughs> it's okay. Well, you can crouch. Um, yeah, now shoot those bad boys. Um, yeah, he hasn't seen any speedruns yet. Um, Brian, I was going to tell you. Yeah. The volume actually next time we'll probably want to take it down like 20% or something because I can barely hear right now. He's like, rah, rah, rah. Oh, you can barely hear me? Yeah, I can barely hear you because he's oh, so yeah, loud. Yeah. He's like, his screams like really loud. You got this, Brian. Switch to your missiles. You got it. Oh no, he's in chaos. Yes! Damn. Very good. He's actually not easy. For somebody who's figuring out the controls, Brian, that was really good. Usually, people I would say take about three to four times. Yeah, I would have. I would have probably given up if I was a kid. Yeah, <laughs> I would have been like, sense. I'm done. Good job. But now you've got the what you call mines. Everybody else calls the bombs, but um, well, those, they're mines because are... they take a second to. Bombs no, don't true. don't take like bombs explode immediately. They're like grenades. Well, you know these hosh posh old retro gamers. They call everything from the manual, right? Ah. Uh, <laughs> Whatever the Japanese decide is canon. So. Well, they also <laughs> didn't have very good uh, translations of English, so <laughs> that's, true. that's why they would have said mines, if they. I got. I could have to. Uh, I'll have to like sound share a song one time. My <laughs> favorite Japanese song, where the guy sings in English, and like uh, uh, it's really funny. <laughs> it's like this. Uh, it's like super emotional song, and it's like an older Japanese guy doing it. It's really funny. It's really good. All right. So um, All right, now so. bomb that wall right there, and you can you you just let me know whenever you're done playing now, and we can be done. Um, but I, because that's that's yeah. a, like I said, that's it'll be neat because like even in Zelda, mm -hmm. you got to the point where the game really gets started. Maybe that's what we can do in a lot of these. It's you're basically playing off the intro to the game. Yeah, that's that's basically what the idea of these are. Is like, hey, let's play the intro yeah. and say, is is this compelling enough for me to continue to play? You know? Yeah, that's great. Because that's a, great a lot of people. Like, that's what they want to know. Do you, yeah. you? Well, yeah, yeah. It's also kind of judging, like it's judging the game in like a, a way. I mean, everyone can review a game, but like to like look at it, like at that aspect, it's just like a different way to judge it because yeah. 
some people will tell you i'm sure you've heard this like with tv shows like oh no dude you gotta you gotta watch the first season and then it gets good true it's like well then it's not that good then like then it's like also kind of bad and like i i feel like that's pretty pretty important with with games too like yeah. people will be like, oh no, it's good. You just gotta keep playing. It's like, well, if half of the game you have to like wait to re- till it's good, then it's it's not necessary. Like then sure, you're right. It is good in some ways. Like I'm not gonna say it's not a good game in any way, but there's something that is upsetting about like there's something that that like it's it, it could have been better than. I guess. Yeah, I agree. I agree. You know, that's that's a great uh, perspective. I think that's uh, awesome what we're doing. So this is great. Yeah. <laughs> Those things are the only neutral enemy in the game. So it's like they don't attack you unless you attack them. Yeah. So. It's like a, some kind of plant life. Yeah, he won't hurt you either. You can also get on top of him. Yeah, okay, good. There, there's there's things in this game that are classified as friendly. Um, that's mm-hmm. one of the only neutral things in the game. And then there's um, bad. So that's I thought that was kind of interesting. They have that. Mm-hmm. Oh, the music's picking up. Yeah. We're getting serious now. Yeah. Um, yeah, so basically there's zones too, and all the zones have their own theme, so it's pretty neat. Oh, it took more than one hit. <laughs> okay. I only have two rockets, so I won't be able to open those. It's so funny the things I think when I'm watching this game. So much different than somebody starting, you know? Right, and just so like where uh, you go, like when you need... Yeah. Like I know, yeah. like... Yeah. Like go I, ahead. Well, there's so many of these things, and like I'm like, okay, I have to go get rockets now. But if if yeah. um if I knew that already, I would have already gotten the rockets on the way. Right. Exactly. And saved them. Exactly. And not yeah, have so wasted just... them on that plant. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> that did, that very... won't that I can't kill and won't fight me. <laughs> <laughs> right. Right. But I uh I love this. All right, it's here fun we go. watching somebody who has you guys no idea where to go. Mm-hmm. Well, is. we're gonna do it this really one is. first since. I'm here now. Yeah. I almost, I, if you didn't know rockets, like, like, were the way to open those things, not everyone would ever even open those, you know? You're right. They wouldn't even get past that point. Like you're saying, they just get frustrated and be done with it. Some kids. What? This is, (laughs) okay. Try Uh, it. Try it out. Turn into a ball and then just start bombing. Oh. There's a lot of secrets in this game, so just keep that in keep that in mind. Too. Yeah. Whoa. Um. Oh, does it bomb? Morphing yeah. call. And so, for um, for unexplained reasons, you can turn items on and off. Like, so why would you want to do that? Um, but I'll leave it up to any of the randoms that may come in here. You can comment about all this type of stuff. We'd love for your comments and for you to tell us all sorts of things about this game. Uh, one of the things I'd like you to write in there, if you're somebody who knows a lot about this game, is write, why would you want to turn your gear on and off? What's the point of that? Like, why would you do that after you get good gear? So. I'll leave that up to... In Deus Ex, you do it because you can't have all of the gear equipped at the same time. Well, that's a, that's also a really well thought out reason, but this one's not as... Um, it's not as intentional as that. It's mm-hmm. more um, secret, and it's more for hardcore fans to figure out, not... Yeah. Not um, for casual noobs. Exactly. That's exactly <laughs> right. They, were, they knew people were going to play the trash out of this game yeah and so because back in the day it, you you did because you just like that's what darksiders is to me like it's a game uh, that you would play more I already have a missile yeah but you get more uh, it, you're, it's you're it's it's passing. a game that you would play you like if you had to like start over again mm-hmm. then you would um but it's the only game you have like you're gonna play like you're gonna continue to play it you know what i mean right but you're not gonna continue to play it if you're like okay well but i have a hundred other games like i'm i'm not gonna but like when if it costs you're not gonna waste your time if it costs five hundred dollars to like you know yeah not five five hundred dollars but 
I'm yeah, stuck I know what forever. you're saying. All the time, all the time spent into it, right? And so that brings up a very uh, interesting fact um, or point. Again, like we were talking about before, like how is the the older generation, right? Um, gonna want to do or like what the new generation does and vice versa because we don't have the same value system anymore because there's so much currency right so there's like there's so many games that you could just grab that would be more fun right off the bat yeah and it plays into your point like what you're saying if you can't like the game right off the bat it's probably not worth a person's time anymore yeah. but i'm sure that wasn't being thought of because this was the only thing out then yeah so people played whatever they could play yeah um yeah do you want to tell them about running or something okay if you hold um i think i believe what's on the xbox controller is um yeah there you go but still look at what happened right there so you need an item later i'll save you the headache ah. so um, okay. there is a speed running technique that will get you under there early and that's what i was thinking of yeah the whole no entire we're time good that. but we're not gonna do that no. it's hard for me to do and these guys say oh that's easy that's, that's the easy, easy part stuff. <laughs> yeah, and I'm like, no, that's that's one of the harder techniques. I can moonfall better. They say moonfalling is hard, but for whatever reason, my brain operates differently. Um, I'm going to save you some time. That's the door right there. You're, you must be enjoying this game because Zelda, I can yeah. tell you're already done with it, but you're like, I don't you're know. still going. You're not saying anything about being done with it, so um. you must like it. It's okay. I honestly, yeah. I, I, I'm not sure if, if I like Zelda more. I, I might. Really? Okay. Maybe. That's good. You're hard to pin down, man, with how you do stuff. So it'll be interesting going forward, me trying to figure out what you're thinking. That's bomb. Yeah. Like, I... Or uh, mine. Yeah. I'll use your terminology. That'll be fun, too. I'll use everything that you say. I'm not going to correct you. Because <laughs> this is like... This is the real deal. It's like we're in first grade again, and we went to school. And we argue and like, about Do it. Do you remember that? It's not yeah. a bomb. It's a mine. Oh, no, it's yeah. not. <laughs> it's a bomb. It says in the manual. <laughs> oh, I don't have the manual. I bought it used. <laughs> I watch Captain Planet. <laughs> <laughs> is that what kids said when you when you were? <laughs> <laughs> yep. Well, I'm going to be Captain Planet. I'll be the fire ring dude. <laughs> <laughs> Health is low. It is very low. Ah. <laughs> the cheap is strong it's with almost, this one. <laughs> it's almost like that was placed there for you to farm. That's interesting. I always think about like the genius of some of these people in these old games mm -hmm. right because they didn't have much to work with yeah. so they're like how could we make it more entertaining and more fun for these people to yeah. play this uh go back there uh, yeah go I in there and then bomb uh, s stands for save point right and get in there and hit your uh, equivalent of an a button yeah, there you go. Perfect. Well, we are a little bit, we're like at 30, 32 minutes now, so. Okay. We did yeah. play the first 32 minutes of Metroid. If I, if this is the game I had when I was a kid and I didn't get frustrated enough, I would have loved it. <laughs> I think yeah. the problem is, is like, what, what, what year did this come out? Um, This was 93, I believe. Right, so I was four years old. I wouldn't have, but I probably wouldn't yeah. have gotten it until I was like six because obviously I'm not buying a $120 cartridge when I'm four. <laughs> yeah. yeah. But uh, uh, I, so I, I would have got it used at a yard sale for $3 uh -huh. when I was seven years old. Um, but uh, if I, yeah, I missed out on games like this back then. I was just playing Donkey Kong and Mario and um, Final Fantasy Mystic Quest. Yeah. So, like, I never had, like, Donkey Kong was the only, like, game I had to play where it was, like, platforming. And like okay. hard. Well, actually, That'll, also, you know what is, is similar to this is um, Shadows of, or not Shadows, uh, Empire Strikes Back, that Star Wars game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're right. That's the game that's I played. Platform. I played when I was a little bit older, but I just, yeah, I just never played Metroid. I just, I didn't have it. I didn't have any friends that played S Super Nintendo back then. I was the only yep. one that had it, so I, I didn't know what games were good. I just had whatever games I had. And my aunt yeah. worked at Blockbuster, so she would just give me random games that like they couldn't use anymore at Blockbusters. Mm -hmm. 
That's so, awesome. I would that's just get really random. Neat. Dude, that's like that's like that's like a nostalgic yeah. feeling. Um, right there in and of itself, a person that gave you video games. Like so yeah. at Ray's video, we knew the manager, they gave us Mario 3. Mm-hmm. Um, mm. uh, like a Japanese cartridge that's worth like mm-hmm. thousands of dollars now <laughs> <laughs> to take home and demo. Mm-hmm. So like it had this red ribbon on it. It was like a white cartridge mm-hmm. or something. Dude. is incredible. You know what yeah. game, speaking of games that are worth a lot of money, Skies of Arcada is like worth like $300 on the GameCube. Is it? Yeah. Wow. I know. We used to have and it. You, do you still have it? I, I might. It, it would I be. You? I don't remember. I might. Did I buy it for you for I don't, your birthday? I, think I don't I remember. It I think you. Yeah. No, no. I think you had it. You bought it for yourself, and then you gave it. And to I me. gave it to you. Yeah. Yeah. That yeah. game was, and I was like, dude, you like RPG games? You're gonna. Dude, love I love this that game. I. Isn't it? It's an experience. It, we should play that sometime on one of these. Yeah. It, it would be like a Dreamcast. I never played it on Dreamcast. I'd only played it on GameCube. But that. That like a used copy is like three hundred dollars on eBay. Yeah, <laughs> like yeah, it's not easy. Um, it's not easy to get working, but um, I can get it working if you if you ever want to stream that sometime. If, and I think if that so, would we would do a whole playthrough. I would, I would, yeah, I would want to do a whole okay. playthrough of that game. That game was, yeah. I don't know what it is because it seems like the things in that game that were amazing, people, other games do better now. But yeah. I loved that game. That game was so it's cool. Just, it's the environment, man. It's that that skyland with the beautiful orchestrated right. music. It is. And it's a, just a feeling. Yeah, yeah. And the, the, and the and airships was good too, though. Yeah. Go ahead. The airships. Yeah. Yeah. Well, and you can also like you could. It was one of the first games where you could choose what crew members you had on your ship, like, and they had different stats that would boost like the right. gunning, or or like the speed or the special would go up, and you actually had a little bit of control over your party. Um, yep. I mean, other games had that too but i was used to final fantasy games where it was so scripted on like who was in your party you know right so it was yeah and that's 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 what i was gonna say i think um the funny thing was is i believe on uh ps3 you told me to get final fantasy 7 there will be a come together moment with me and you brian because that that was the game that i played final fantasy 7 on ps3 playstation and I had to take the, the system back because my mom got mad because I stayed up for two days playing it. <laughs> and I was I was like 17, working it in and out. Yeah. And I had to, she, she made me as like almost an adult man take <laughs> my <laughs> system back. And I like didn't game for a while because of it. But oh, that's another yeah. story for another yeah. day because I, I, I dark have days. a sneaky suspicion we'll, we'll end up revisiting that at some point in time yeah. in the future. So. Yeah. Yeah. Well, anyways, right, so yeah, this game it's 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 definitely good. Um, it's a good game. I I don't know if it's better than Zelda though. Honestly, I didn't mind Zelda. Like I I didn't like the controls. This game has a little bit better controls with, than Zelda, I think. I um, agree. But they're still like a little bit wonky. But I mean, yeah, that's just old school systems. Well, man, that's good, Doctor Doctor Brian. Uh, or Genji Gear, Dr. Genji Gear telling us how it is, diagnosing it. And it's very interesting for me because I'm realizing that people don't have the same feelings that I do towards stuff. But that's great. That's it, a- and it's fun doing it this yeah. way. No, it really is. Yeah. It's fun doing it this way. I like it. Um, and it's giving me a different perspective on how people view things now. So it's educational for me. Yeah. So it's good. Cool. All right, buddy. All right. Well, thanks for everything. And let us know in the yeah. comments if you want us to play a different game next time. Let us know. Yeah. Awesome. All right. I'll talk to you you guys later.